You ready for this? Oh yeah. Dream Aero Simulator. Have you done it before? Or? Yeah, yeah. Remember we uh, we saw yeah. We saw uh, that. That was loud. Yeah. yeah. We want to start, so we can't fly from any place. Uh, we're gonna try to do two takeoffs and landing. Alright. And uh, you take a place. You know, this is just a regular. Yeah, he's got. Kyle's got the phone. This thing's a very Do impressive. You know Absolutely, man. Seven, seven, yeah. I would yes. love to see. Okay, cool. Uh, we, no. just, we just came from DC at the 1 9 and we're watching the drums come in. Okay. Uh, you said we're going to do one takeoff, one landing? We're going to try to do uh, two. two flaps, five. So we're going to do it. Yep. And then uh, two and five. All right, good. Well, RTL? Yep, yeah, RTO. Which is, you know what RTO stands for? We're going to climb up to. And uh, we're going to fly runway heading. Alright, so it's uh, 96 or 100? Uh, just do 97. 97. Like you want to use this. Alright, so now my, t my trim is not. Uh, I'll let you do it. Alright, and uh, no smoking sign, seatbelt no sign. Seat signs are on. Right. Let's go. Go back. Oh, put your auto battle on. Auto battle. Oh, that's right. Oh, my God. So you don't want to overdo uh, it on the uh, flight control, right? right? Just do the light, steady uh, touch. Yeah. Right. Just going to come in, maintain 9,000 feet. Got South Beach out there. Right. After takeoff, check is complete. Uh, we got engine blades off and pack auto, flaps up, gear off. 
So what I realize is that you're watching the flight when I turn on this way more than you do on your regular desktop sitting. Because you asked for it. No, no, no. Well, I like it. I like it. It's actually giving me a reference point to aim to. It's all right, so we got 230 on the speed. Um, 6,000 coming up here. Not very good to say that other beats. And we can see Miami off to the right there. 5,000. I didn't realize it was that close to Miami. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. All right, go ahead and turn on right and fly heading uh, 270. How's that yoke uh, feel? I'm gonna go back uh, west. Yeah, let's do a whole time. That yoke getting heavy, ain't it? Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Turns, uh, 20 degrees of bank angle is your standard. 20 is standard. Yeah, 30 is your max. Absolutely. Over 30 is over your bank angle. Alright. How you back to the <laughs> I'm like, uh, I don't think you should waste any time with me trying to play. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think right, you guys should spend the time. All right, thousand to go. And then you're gonna trim a lot with this uh, airplane, so don't forget to trim. If you feel like it's too heavy, all right, you trim. Trim with this, right there. Then roll out straight to seven. So I'm gonna get used to when to start the roll. Alright, right, good. We're going to hold 2.30. There we go. Level flight. Let's see if I can maintain level flight. That's the key. The key is the trim. No, we're good. It out. We're good. Yeah, we're good on it. Oh, sure. yeah. All right. Continue your straight. Oh, no. We're not close like that. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Yeah. See what they do with my one horse. Straight to the sunlight. Yeah. Alright, so let's go ahead and descend and maintain 5,000. Where's the part? This is why autothrottle is your friend. So you can concentrate on flying. Right. Keep that speed. So. 2,000 feet a minute? Uh, less than that. We want to do 1,000 feet per minute. Uh, you see, you you can feel the immersion. Like oh, yeah. everything you do, you get a response. Oh, that's yeah. crazy. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. That's the only thing that's missing from the sim world, man. Turn our left, fly heading two hundred. Oh, just do a two one, two two zero. Watch your bank angle. When do you become comfortable looking outside versus looking at the instrument? Uh, when you fly a jet, you look at the instrument more than you look outside. Except gotcha. when you do a visual approach, yeah, you just gotta look outside. Right, 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 right. I see. Because you want to be ahead of the airplane, so you want to know what's coming. Yeah. <coughs> Got some turbulence over there. Yeah. It's good. Yeah. <laughs> I love the auto throttle moving. Just, yeah, usually it doesn't move like this. In no, no, no. So this one is just, uh, you know, just disconnected. Right. It's 230. Yeah. Coming down yeah. to 1,000 feet a minute. So there's yeah. Miami on the left so the question get asked over right. Would you fly a plane in real life? Of course. Exactly. If you can't fly this, you can't probably. Yeah. Right. It's not, you know. But it's not the same uh, dynamics. Because yeah. this one is not high, all hydraulics. We don't have any hydraulic system here. It's all electric oh, and spring loaded. Yeah, otherwise you'd be paying $1,000 an hour. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right, right, More right. More right, expensive. Right. <laughs> yeah, we're flying on wrong top. 
So I'll give you a vector for uh, the airport, and I'm going to land on runway 27. No problem. Last 5,000 coming up? Yep. Let's maintain 5,000 feet for now, and speed 230. So easy on your little desktop computer. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure if I were, you're doing the autopilot, it's just doing it, it's monitoring it, but hand flying it is... No, you want to learn how to hand fly. The yeah. autopilot is just used just to make it easy, uh, you know, when you do five flights a day, you get really tired. Right. Imagine doing a live stream in this thing, though. Could be autopilot. Yeah. All right, your VRAF is uh, 144 flaps through. Yeah. Oh, it does respond to every, every little touch. Yeah, you want to trip. Just to get that trip 5, I go ahead and turn left, fly heading 140. So you're giving me the overwater approach coming in, which yeah. is harder to do. <laughs> so here's the key, right? Maintaining 5,000 and turning at the same time. Because mm -hmm. the airplane wants so to the airplane The key wants is, to. look at this. Just keep right. your nose in between 2.5 and 5 degrees. Got you. And then you're just going to maintain your altitude just by, yeah, right there. Just hold it right there. That's it. Bank angle. Uh, watch your bank angle. Do 20 degrees of bank angle. The wider you turn, the longer it's going to take you to roll out. Gotcha. And then the airplane is just going to give you a more pitch now because you're losing the lift on one of the wings. Alright, good. Alright, descend and maintain 3,000 feet. It sounded better when we talked about it. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you got this, man. <laughs> Alright, and 1,000 feet per minute. Same thing. <coughs> Hey. Loving the ATC audio chatter in the background. Know, right? It's actually <laughs> so nice. So babe, that audio you hear in the background is what I'm listening to in my headset when I'm, when I'm streaming. Oh, okay. <laughs> we do a uh, back in? Yep, that's okay. a He's a YouTuber. All right, go ahead and turn left, fly heading uh, zero, uh, just do 100. Okay. So I'm a YouTuber. I stream on YouTube. Oh, okay. Man, I don't understand how you can do this, listen to eight bets, um, <laughs> and read the chat, and respond at the same time. Yeah, that's multitasking. Uh, <laughs> I, I couldn't do all of that. I know, uh, it's called you know Ben, he's a United pilot. He streams on uh, TikTok mostly. Ben. Yeah. 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 Alright, just gonna maintain 3,000 feet for now. Hey, TikTok is a thing by the way, just for me. Yeah, it's, it's, it's the new, new place to go, yeah. yeah. YouTube is. Down in the city. So, hey, there's your office down here. Yeah, yeah. South yeah. Beach. It's Brickle, yeah. Very good. So the 737, you don't really land with all the throttle. Uh, if you do a fly, auto land full cat three, yeah. Use the auto right, Once you touch down, just uh, disconnect your auto Alright, and then you go ahead and turn left, fly heading uh, north, descend and maintain 2000. Alright, we're going to slow you down to 210. Here's the fun part. This is why this is a two, two person <laughs> operation <laughs> in a commercial jet. Well, when you fly the autopilot, yeah, but if you hand fly it, you can do it by yourself. Uh, watch your banking, banking, 20 degrees, and you can roll out, roll out, roll out, roll out. There we go, right there, hold it right there, that's it. Alright, 2,000 feet. Alright, so now we're, we're coming on base, all the way to 7. Let's see what you can do. Alright. So, should be off to our left shoulder over there. Yeah, there she is. Okay. I'm going to turn left, 
to the sun. <laughs> Crazy how it really feels like it's, know, it's, it's slowing right. down in the air, like <laughs> like you're hitting yeah. the brakes. One thousand feet per minute, all, all the way down, down, all the way down. All right, that's trim a little more. There you go. Two rears, two rights. Looking good. Uh, no, no, don't add more power. Don't add more power. Like no power. Yeah, just uh, keep the power steady up at about fifty. Uh, Light slow. slow. Light slow. Light slow. Right there. Oh, yeah, he's gonna butter this <laughs> one. On the throttles, be ready. He got it. Right. One hundred. He got it. It's very Plus similar to the controls. Right on the center line. Fifty. Right. Forty. Thirty. Let it go. Uh, nice. Nice. Your rudder. What did it say? Kissing landing? Kissing oh, landing. <laughs> 60 feet per minute? What? <laughs> <laughs> what? Wow. <laughs> Ooh, sweating on that one. <laughs> what? Versus <laughs> off. Yeah, that's the best one you can do with oh, this one. Yeah. How did it feel? Heavy. Heavy. <laughs> Big bird. Yes. Lots of information that I already know, but when you're in the real thing and flying, it's not like your desktop simulator in any way because right. it's a lot more to. It almost feels like when I just started in, in the desktop. Simulator. Yes. Yes. So. Yeah. Yeah. The one one element that we're missing. It's you know what I mean? It's a thousand percent more feedback. Yes. 